Today, we are talking about a very important topic, timing. As a slap hitter, it's going to be so crucial that we know how to control our timing. Hello, Natasha Watley here, two-time Olympian, and I help softball athletes become game changers. Welcome. So our timing, what it is, it's when we actually start our actual movement, our actual steps, to be able to be on time to make contact. So what is on time? On time in my world as a slap hitter is late. So a couple ways to get good at timing is to perfect starting as late as you possibly humanly can. So whether you're facing front toss, whether you're facing machine, or you're actually facing an actual pitcher, how late can you start and let the ball get off of your left hip so that you can go left side? And again, we wanna make sure that we're going left side because left side, five, six hole, furthest throw on the infield that's going to be the hardest way to get us as speedsters out. Another way to help your timing is doing the three play drill. I love doing this drill because it helps you feel the different speeds of a pitcher. So if you have three home plates and you set them up and probably they need to be about a foot away from each other or maybe two feet away from each other. You can see them placed down here. You're gonna start at the furthest home plate and work your way up to the closest home plate to a pitcher. And the whole idea is to think about when I'm starting at that furthest home plate, that's gonna make me have to start later. The closer I move up, the earlier I'm going to start with my steps so that I can be on time and make sure that I'm hitting this ball left side. So in conclusion, we are talking about timing. Timing is when you are actually going to start so that you can get into preparation and getting to that contact. Why is it so important? Because timing is always going to be different in every scenario that you're in, whether you're facing a fast pitcher, you're facing a slow machine, you're facing front toss, like timing is always going to be of essence. You're facing different pitchers that have different windups, they have different speeds to their pitches. So it's so important to know how to make your adjustments internally to make sure that you are on time. Again, in my definition, late is on time. So when I am late and I am getting that ball to that five, six hole as a slap hitter, I know that I'm going to be in the groove and I know that I'm gonna be able to challenge that defense. Again, a couple of ways to work on this is changing the different times of when you're starting your different slaps by doing the three plate drill, that's one way. And another way is just challenge yourself to start as late as you possibly humanly can when you're facing a pitcher or you're facing a machine. You guys are going to be great at this. Have a lot of fun, best of luck. Write down in the comments how timing works for you. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for joining.